Hey guys, another Doom World Slot Reviews here, and this is a McLaren MP4-12C GT3 car. Now some of you may have the McLaren road car, and it's a very good car. So this one is quite a good car as well, and it's taken a while for it to come out. It was meant to come out in 2012, but um, this one came out on time, which was pretty good. But obviously the super resistant one is still yet to come out. So, but we got this one just now, we got it from the Model Zone website and where they had the 15% off, we uh, ordered two, so I've got one now my dad's got one. So, we'll just quickly go through the code. The code is C3, uh, focus is rubbish, C3287, and this is McLaren MP4-12C G3, number 21, United Auto Sports Golf Livery. Now, Skyship do lots of Golf Livery cars. And some of them have been Aston Martins, load of Aston Martins, and Lamborghinis. So they're the other ones that I know of. Um, apart from a few, maybe Ford GT they did, Ford GT40 that they did ages ago. So I say this is one of the nicest and they've well, most well detailed cars that they've done. And they've really gone all out on it because they want it to be perfect. And they've done it very well. So I guess the rate was worth it. Now, one thing we found out straight away was the magnet was straight under the rear wheels, exactly like the Camaro, and they've also left in the one that's on the road car. So you have a choice of two magnets, one magnet, and or no magnets, wherever you want them. It's digital plug ready, and I think this will be an excellent di uh, digital car, so that's another good reason to get this car. Now, it is £40 if you get it from Model Zone or if you buy it brand new, but there is always eBay, and... Also, if you're a member, you can get it for Model Zone for 10% off. So, what else is there really to say about this car? Um, this was going to be the number 60 Von Ryan Racing one, and I thought maybe they should have just stuck with the fact that they were going to do the plain orange one, so then they would have been able to get them out quicker, but obviously that makes no difference on the fact that they haven't even released the super resistant one on, and that one's as, like, that one's as plain as they get. I did a quick test on this car, drove it around, um, I will be doing the test drive video on it, but it is very nice handling as well and very nice to drive. I guess the reason why they've done the Golf one is because Golf is such an iconic livery, everyone knows Golf and there's so much racing history behind Golf and, and I guess it was a good idea, plus it's United Auto Spot and they announced that they're going to be doing the red, white and blue colour scheme for the United Auto Sport car and it's I, I'm quite happy about that, it's also that one's a detailed one so these two will go very nicely together and I like, I do like this car, it looks fantastic they've even, they've done the real arc bit here which is very nice and they've secured it quite nicely so it looks like it's going to be very hard to knock off so Really, the only thing that does come off will be the wing. That will probably get broken if you crash it too much. And while testing it, we did um, knock off one of the winners in a Morris Mini Police accident. So, um, yeah, that comes out. But that's that was quite good. It didn't snap or break. It just popped out like that, and it goes in. It goes in nicely again. Um, yeah, there we go. So yeah, I would say this is definitely one of the cars that was most anticipated. And the detail on it, again, I just love the detail on this car. It's really well done. It's really well presented, this car. And I just think they've done the best they can for this car because they really wanted it right. And it, all the other cars will look like this. So definitely worth getting. And it will definitely be one of the best cars that they do for a long time. It may, to be honest, in my opinion, may even replace the Audi R8. So that's how good I think it is. And I love the Audi R8 to the extent of having every single one that they made and even being willing to buy the police car versions. <laughs> so, and also spraying as many as that. I've got four sprayed ones, including the Model Zone one just there. So that's, that's quite an, an insane relationship for a car. So, you know. Uh, yeah, I'm hopefully looking forward to being able to get loads of these, spraying them. So this will probably be will probably be one of the cars that you know I'll get quite a lot of, and then like I said, we'll spray them, and 
Um, it will be. It's the car that I'm going to change in the championship to in a couple of years, hopefully. So, you know, if you watch the racing videos, there is. And so, um, that's why I like it so much. And I've always kind of liked the McLaren. And it's just so mean looking. So, that's why I was going to do it. Um, so, yeah, if you're not really a massive fan of McLaren, it's uh, not going to be a f very fun for you to watch all the, uh, you know, paint jobs that I do. But, you know, I don't mind. People do like this car. Um, I've been looking through all the other McLaren videos I've done. They've been quite popular, so um, people obviously show their appreciation for this car, it being British and as well. So, um, thanks for watching. Again, please rate, comment, and subscribe. Please check out Dean Wall's Sport Reviews. And also go onto my channel and look at all the other channels that I've featured. There's quite a few there, and um, many of them have also featured me. So, you know, I'm all about helping that little man here, so <laughs> I don't mind uh, giving people, you know, helps and tips. And um, please, if you if you need subscribers, just um, subscribe to me and I'll subscribe back uh, if you ask for it as well. Okay, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment and subscribe and check out all the other channels.